Hi. I was just praying because I hope the universe doesn't end. Oh. The universe will end in three possible ways. I hope the universe doesn't the, end. The, the big freeze, the big rip, and the big crunch. Let's start with the big freeze. Can you tell me about it? Okay. Imagine... Two objects representing galaxies. A short, tight rubber band is holding them together. That's the attractive force of gravity. Meanwhile, two hooks are pulling them apart. That's the repulsive force expanding the universe. Copy this many times, and you have the real universe. The battle between these two. Opposing forces is how the end of the universe will play out. Wow! The big freeze is when the thing pulling apart the rubber band is just strong enough that it stretches the rubber band till it loses its elastic to its elastic limit. What happens? The expansion of the universe wouldn't be able to accelerate anymore, but the universe will keep getting bigger. Clusters of galaxies, suns, planets, and solar systems will move away from each other, and the gas emanating from those stars will be too thin to create new stars. And the light. A minute from those stars will be so short, a wavelength and and redshifted, approaching the frozen state, known as the big chill or the heat death of the universe. Well, that sounds scary. So that's the big freeze. What's the other theory? Big rip. What if the 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 force pulling apart the rubber band is so strong that it stretches the rubber band past its elastic limit and tears gravity? Oh my God! Then, then the universe expansion will continue to accelerate. Star stars planets stars will the gas from the stars will rip apart to tiny pieces. Even atoms and subatomic particles will be destroyed. Everything will be ripped into pieces. That's the big rip.、Okay. What about the dirt scenario, where the rubber band wins out? This explains the possible future. The oh, when of when you of that of. Big... Star galaxies、yes. will will collide. Stars too too will hurtle together and collide. And their gravitational net forces will get even stronger. And space will become tighter and tighter. The size of the universe will plummet from ninety billion kilometer light years to to. To barely,、uh, to barely even big. So what's that? And、called? that's that's the that that's called the big crunch. It will co- that's collapsing in back into a singularity and big bang again. Oh my God!、Mm-hmm. That's so interesting. Well, now let's explain a universe. That that keeps expanding and contracting over and over again. You know what that's called?、Mm, I don't know. It's called the big bounce. No, not bounce as in bouncing ball. Bounce in the name, big bounce. So what does that type of universe do? Well, that type of universe is expand and contract. Like first, expand. Big rip, then big crunch, 
into back into a singularity, expand back again, rip everything apart, contract again into a singularity, like that. See? But imagine this is the universe. It's ninety billion light years. The table. Yes, the table. And let's imagine that when it collapses into a singularity, it pulls itself inwards. See? Look, look. It'll go from from this size to this size, then to this size, then to this size, and to then to this size, then to this size, and then to this size, and then to a point that's not visible, smaller than an atom. Really? Yeah. So what happens next? It will explode again, like this, and then it will explode, expand to this size again. Rip it apart to this side, and then, and then go smaller than the atom again. That's crazy. So that's the big bounce. Yes, that's the big bounce. Wow. The bounce says each bounce will wipe away a record from the universe. So what does that mean? That it wipes away a record? Well, the bounce is like like a box. A box that that like help will will get rid will get rid of a record of the universe. So the u- new universe will be a little bit different. You mean? Yes, the new universe will be a little bit different. But we'll get to other universes in another episode. If you want to learn about the other universes, check out our episode called Multi Universes. And also have a great day. Uh, if you want to see more videos like my nice neutron starting in the observable universe, click here. It's called It Science Time Season One. <laughs> I hope I hope you enjoyed my video. I, I enjoyed so much. Stay tuned, and I see you next time. Bye.